Hi, everybody. It's Tom Woods. And if you have been listening to me for any length of time, you know I'm constantly telling people, start a blog. Go out there and start your blog. It's a wonderful way to join the conversation on a lot of important issues, to pursue a labor of love, to improve as a writer. There's no better and quicker path to improving your writing than composing short, concise pieces for the general public on a regular basis. There are many, many reasons to start a blog, but you already know that. That's why you're watching this video. What I want to do in this video is get you over that first hump, because a lot of people feel like they'd like to start a blog, but they don't know where to begin, what the first steps are, so they wind up just not doing it. Well, you won't have any excuse after this video, because I'm going to show you just how easy it is. And then after the video, you can flip through my free ebook, flip through it virtually, of course, which you see here on the screen. It's linked in the description of this video. It is free. You don't have to sign up for any mailing list. There's no secret trick involved. But if you'd like to find out more about how to make your site even better and get people keep on coming back to visit it, that's the place to go. But let's get started. The first thing you are going to need is a hosting company. I recommend Bluehost, which I myself use for one of my websites. You can get over there via tomwoods.com slash blue, which is a discounted link. It's my affiliate link. And you will see a screen just like the one you see here on your screen on YouTube right now. Now, it may change over time, but this is more or less what you're going to see over at Bluehost. And what you're going to do is click Get Started Now. And what you'll do here is look through the different packages they have and what the heck, let's choose the cheapest package. Why not, right? $3.95 per month. And now let's choose a domain. Let's assume we're starting from scratch, we're starting a brand new site. What do we want to name it? Well, I'll name it something that I know no one in his right mind has taken so that we can continue along here. Let's, let's think of something really hideous. Like, this is my first website. Not really. Because, of course, it's not really my first website. This is just a demonstration. So we click Next to see if that domain name is available. And I would be shocked if it wasn't. And there it is. This is my first website, notreally.com, is available. Well, how about that? So on this screen, you're going to enter your account information, your personal information. You're going to choose a package. So I'm going to stick with that cheapest package they have, $3.95 a month. We'll unclick these things and then enter my billing information. Well, of course, I'm going to be entering all this off camera, so to speak, so I will see you in just a moment on the next screen. And there we are. I've entered all my information, and we can skip these upgrades, so we'll go right past the upgrades. And here we are. Congratulations. So now I create a password, and boy, they make it difficult on you. You've got to have 28 different features of this new password, but we're going to do it here. There we go. That's like one of the best passwords I've ever seen. Gets me a 96. Pretty good. But I have to click Terms of Service. Okay, I accept that. Now Create. And off we go. Uh, no, th uh, I have this offer that comes up on the screen. No thanks, I'm not interested in it. And here we are. Now it's asking me, can I do this myself or not? Yes, and you too are going to click I can do it. Don't doubt yourself. Of course you can do it. We'll close this guide. We're going to scroll down and click on, just trust me on this, click on install WordPress. Everybody uses WordPress practically. You'd be crazy not to. So here we go. Now it's giving the option, do you want to do it yourself or pay somebody to do it? Or are you crazy? We're going to do it ourselves. Click install. Here we go. And this is my fir first website, notreally.com, is the domain I'd like to install to. Click. Takes a moment. And here we are. If you want to give your site a name, which certainly you will, You'll click right here, Show Advanced Options, and a menu will come down, and, and one of the options will be Site Name. You can name it My Awesome Website. You probably wouldn't. You could name it Jim's Florist. You could, you know, whatever the site is, you give it the name right here under Show Advanced Options. So we're going to go ahead and click Install Now. 
after the terms and conditions. And here we are. Now, no, 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 we don't want this. No. No, we don't. Thank you for offering. Your install is underway, so we have to just wait for this little thing here to turn green. I would not be tempted to buy these paid themes. Wait for the free themes. They're probably all you need. In other words, the, uh, the appearance of your, of your blog. You don't need to pay for that. All right, the install is complete. Now you want to click View Credentials right up here. And then we're going to click View again. And because there's login information here, I'm only showing you up to a certain point of the screen, but this is all you need to see. This is going to show you, there's your website. This is my first website, notreally.com. And the admin URL is how you log in to the site to do what you need to do to, to post your content. So let's do that right now. Let's go right there. We're going to go to our site. How exciting and thrilling it is, isn't it? And my username is my... Uh, email address. I don't use this email address, so do not try to contact me there. I copied the password from the previous page. Click Login. And guess what, my friends? We are about to post our first post to the site. Our first post. It's amazing. What we can do before the, we do that is choose a theme. So we go to Appearance, click Themes, and you can click up here and you can look around for quite some time and find a nice little old theme that looks good and suitable for your site. Well, just pick one at random. I'm just going to pick this one. doesn't really matter because it's just an example. I will click Install. And before you know it, it is installed. I click Activate. It's all very exciting. The theme is activated. That's great. Let's say yes, we're going to click here. We are ready to launch the site. Nobody knows about it yet, so it won't matter that we haven't posted anything for them to see. Let's do that right now. Let's go over to Posts, Add New, and look how easy this is. If you ever use Microsoft Word, it's pretty much just like that. My first post. And then we can type, I did it. My first post on my blog. There we go. We click Publish. See how simple it is? Publish. And then, bang, it is up there. And we can see what the site looks like. We'll go to, we'll visit the site. You know, I, I haven't given it a name. I showed you where to give it a name so it won't say My Site, which looks kind of stupid. And you can fill in these graphics. You, you, know, there's a, you, you customize these themes. It's very easy to do. But look, there's my first post. I did it my first post on my blog. Fantastic. We did this in record time. It's very, very easy to do. So check out the discounted link in the description of this video below. And also you'll find my free ebook on all kinds of resources that I've used to help people come back to my site, get to track them back to the site, all kinds of different plugins that I've found that are really, really helpful if you want to make a splash online. And, frankly, if you want to sell things online and earn money online. Well, anyway, that's all over at freewebsitebook.com, because it's a free website book, isn't it? Freewebsitebook.com. No strings attached. You don't have to join my mailing list. Nothing. And if you hate it, you can throw it in the garbage. But I bet you will find it helpful, and I hope you found this video helpful. Happy blogging!